people. Let's get into it. First off, I want to give a shout out to Skinny Heme TV, you know, for allowing me to, you know, use this platform to tell a story or two. He been on me about it for a long time now, so, you know, it's a long time coming, so let's get into it. Um, so um, when I was first introduced into the federal system in 2001, you know, I had to learn the hard way, you know, about a lot of things, you know, about how the jails, how they run. So, you know, my first, my first incident that I had, um, I had to learn the hard way about the geographical thing, the, you know, where you got certain people that sit in certain parts of the prison and, 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 and that's they, that's they spot. Oh, excuse me. So, uh, uh, the incident took place in the child hall. And uh, usually when any type of incident happens in the child hall, you you, you can get a, uh, that's a bad write-up, you know, because, you know, it's, it's called inciting a riot because, you know, you can get everybody involved, you know. So with my situation, it, it was kind of crazy because, you know, I, I didn't know what I was getting myself into before the stuff even happened. Um, like I said, I had to learn the hard way about the geographical rules. So me and one of my homies is walking the child. And um, mind you, this is one of them days where, you know, people in prison, you know how you be feeling, a, you know, certain day. Uh, you don't get mail that day. You was expecting some mail, you know. Uh, you was expecting some pictures to come through or you was expecting some money to hit your books. Or, you know, any of that little type of stuff. And, you know. One of them days was, you know, I didn't get no mail that day. I, pictures didn't come and, you know, uh, try to reach out on the phone. Uh, didn't didn't reach who I was trying to reach. So, you know, I was a little, you know, eh, in my feelings that day. You know what I mean? It's, you know, so to speak, I was in my feelings. You know, I'm going to keep it a buck. So I go to the chow hall with this stuff on my brain. And, you know, uh, I get in there. And I look back at the section where me and all my homies, where we all sit at, and it was packed. You know, I'm seeing homies back there that's done eating, but they still, you know, they kicking the boat boat, chopping it up with other homies. You know what I mean? And, you know, I don't I don't I don't mind that, you know, because I'm guilty of that myself. You know, I do that myself. So um, this in particular day, like I said, there was a lot of homies back there. and You know, I was like, OK. You know, I, I came up with a bright idea that, you know, I'm going to sit in another section. But the section where I thought that I was sitting, I'm thinking I'm sitting in a section where it's neutrons. You know, a neutron is is a, is a person in the prison who's who's like a non-affiliate. You know, they're not really connected to nothing. You know, these guys are they last for everything. You know, you use the phone last. You 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 wash your clothes last. You you know you eat last. You know what I mean? Like these guys is last. You know what I mean? Not to say that they cowards are weak, nothing like that. But you know that's that's just how it goes in prison. You know you know uh, the guys uh, kind of like uh, that's that that's that's moving in in a unit. You know with power. You know kind of get first dibs on everything. You know what I mean, so to speak. So, uh, like I said, I, I'm thinking I'm sitting in the neutron section. And come to find out, it, it, it wasn't a neutron section at all. I was sitting in the section of where the um, vice lords, the G's, you know, they call it the coalition. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, but I, I, I didn't mean no disrespect. You know, I actually thought that I was sitting in a neutron section. Where the, where, the, where the neutrons sit. So I was wondering why these guys kept looking out over there at me. I'm looking at the guys coming in through the child hall, through, coming through the door, and they looking right at me and my homeboy. They like, what like that? And I hear them talking. Well, I, I don't hear them talking, but I see their mouth moving and they looking over in, in my direction. Now, even if I would have got up right then and there, and when it sat with my homies, I still would have got approached about that. You know what I mean? No matter what, I still would have got approached about that. You know what I mean? But uh, so 
while I'm eating, the guys, they come over. And he slams his tray down. Bam! He slammed his tray down real hard. And, uh, you know, I stopped eating. I look up at the guy. And, and he asked me, he was like, uh, you, you GD? I was like, nah, man. He was like, uh, you vice lord? I'm like, nah, man, I ain't none of that. You know, I ain't none of that. You know what I mean? And he was like, well, you got to get up. This is where we sit at. And, you know, blase, blase, blase. We with the coalition and all this. And I'm like, hey, man, I don't look here, man. I, I'll get up when I finish eating. Like I said, I was kind of already in my feelings, you know, about not getting no mail that day. Not you being able to talk on the phone or who I was trying to reach out to. You know, let's normal stuff that you go through while you're in prison. But uh, you know, it was it was all it was all about how the how the dude came at me. Like, man, he came at me like, you know, he was he was he was punking me. You know what I mean? And like that's that's the last thing you 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 wanna let somebody do to you in prison is, is punk you because you know once they it's like sharks when they smell blood, you know what I mean? They gonna come they gonna come for you. So, you know, I couldn't let him talk to me like this, you know what I mean? And uh, I, I, I guess he didn't. He thought that you know I wasn't, you know, standing on mines or whatever. Like he didn't know me well. I mean, he could have known. Like you know, he he was um uh, he was doing what he was supposed to do. I I, I got to give him that. You know, I'm sitting over in this man's section, but like I said, I didn't know. But it was like how he came to me though. So one word led to another, and uh. I told him that, you know, yeah, I'll get up when I finish eating. He he didn't like that. He didn't like, he didn't like that I said that. He like, nah, you finna get up now. You finna, you finna get up right now. And, uh, and like, man, you know, I ain't, I ain't going nowhere, man. So I finish eating. And mock right at that that man, the dude rocked me. Hey y'all, he he stole on me so hard, man. The dude. uh, he had me seeing stars. I mean, it got real bright. Like, I don't know if y'all ever been hit so hard where it just get real bright till you bam. But yeah, it, it got real bright. As soon as he hit me, bam. But me knowing, you know, what what just transpired, I know I gotta respond. And and, and I gotta respond in, in a in a fashion so, so well that you know, cause this is my stage now. Everybody's watching. You know what I mean? This, this your time to shine, man. So, so once I rose to my feet, and uh, you know, I went after him, and 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 uh, you know, I just kind of just blacked out. I don't, I don't really remember. All I do, all I do remember is, you know, you know, punching, 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 punching. Just, I'm just punching. I'm just. I'm just going crazy. I'm just punching and punching. And I see the police coming. But I don't stop. You know, so uh, they come with the pepper spray. Yeah, they they they, they spraying us down. But, you know, in the midst of all that, you know, I'm like, nah, this ain't over with. You know what I mean? So me and I'm I'm still going after this guy because I'm just so full of rage and you know, I'm 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 pissed. Like, man, like out of all these people in this prison, man, you you pick me to come walk up on and you know put your hands on me. You know what I mean? Like I said, I was having a bad day. I, I was having a bad day, and uh, but respect to the guy because you know I I gotta give him his respect because you know he like I said he did what he was supposed to do. You know if uh, he wouldn't have said nothing to me about sitting over there in a section. You know, they would have been looking kind of like, kind of soft. And don't nobody want to look soft in prison. You know what I mean? Like, this is uh, high testosterone at, at its highest. You know, everybody walking around feeling like, you know, they that guy. You know what I mean? Because it's, it's kind of like a, a, a defense mechanism. Like, if, if, I, if I put it on like this, you know, dudes would think that, you know, you know I'm, I'm, I'm Billy Badass or whatever. But, you know, I never carry myself like that. You know, I'm. I was. If anybody know me, they know that. You know, I'm the kind of like chill person. Like, only time I'm gonna get cracking if it's you know, if I gotta get cracking. I'm just not just gonna just be starting 
starting stuff with people. But you know, that ain't that ain't my get down. Uh, I was just in there to try to do my time and get on the bottom there. But you know, that's prison. You know, even if you're trying to lay back, you know, stuff happens. You know what I mean? So, uh, you know, I end up going to the hole, and uh, he end up going. We both go to the hole, and uh, I'm in there for probably about like three days, and then I come outside. Well, in the cage. You know, we, we, that's that's how we wreck in, in the cage, and we just you know walk around like animals. Like, you, know, you look in at a lion, and you see him in there just walking around, and yeah, that was us. You know, like caged animals. But you know, we had other people that could come out too. You know, but they would be like in another cage, and we talking to each other through the cages. So. You know, I see somebody and 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 uh, he was asking me, man, what 